Okay, today we're doing uh, boxing using bands. Um, the first workout is resistance squats. Legs are a very important component of boxing. And you can see we have the band underneath, uh, underneath his feet. He's going to have his hands right about the shoulder width. And then come down as if you're going into a chair. Okay, the second workout is pretty much the same as this, uh, the first with the resistance squats. The only difference is you want to step a little uh, higher up on the band to make them shorter on your arms to add a little more resistance, or you can do, even do the same thing with more bands. Just do the same thing with hands at the shoulders and squat in the chair. Next exercise we have for boxing is the chest press with a band. So you tie it off on something sturdy, as if maybe a door. Um, and you want to have them about shoulder width, and you're just going to push forward. Uh, your ability to push your opponent around the ring is uh, very key. Okay, the third exercise is going to be an overhead press. Uh, for this one, you stand on the bands again, and you want to start about shoulder level, and you just push straight up. This is another one of those exercises. The more you step up on the bands, the shorter they are on the arms, the more difficult it's going to be. Okay, our fourth exercise is going to be a uh, rear fly. Uh, this works uh, a lot of shoulders, rotator cuff. Uh, a lot of the punches you're going to throw is going to be a lot of uh, strain on your shoulder. Uh, so these are great. Once again, you want to tie it off to a stable place, have them about even. Uh, and as you go, you want to keep your arms straight. On, as you pull, bend them a little bit and only go about even with your body. You don't want to overextend. Okay, for our fifth exercise, we're going to get into uh, some punches. The uh, first one, the most typical, is the jab. And for this, uh, for lefties, you're going to throw with just your right. With righties, it'll just be your left. And as you as you punch, you want to keep your you want to keep your chest square and keep your face on your opponent. Alright, for our final exercise, it's going to be the uppercut. Uh, it's probably the most explosive and most uh, known way to knock out your opponent. And for this one, you just want to tie the bands in a low uh, place so all your force is coming upwards. And same thing, you want to keep the body square to your opponent and then just drop down with your right. Connect right on the jaw.